October is National Cybersecurity Month, so make sure you're ready by securing your accounts. Welcome to this week's Wise Wednesday, a weekly video series where we give you BBB tips and advice to help you become a wiser consumer. October is National Security Month, so we'll be talking about a variety of ways to make sure you stay safe online. Let's start with a review of some good password security tips. According to Data Guardian, the average person has roughly 90 passwords for accounts across the internet. And that was in 2018. We're always going to have a multitude of accounts, and to keep those secure, it's recommended to have a unique password for each one. Using duplicate passwords across accounts significantly increases your risk for identity theft. So here are a few tips to help you generate and remember strong passwords for all of your accounts. First, remember that strong passwords should be long and hard to guess. One way to do this is to use a passphrase that you can remember but others would not know. For example, I once ate only tacos for three weeks. Just make sure the phrase you pick is something unique to you and not something you've posted on social media. If a passphrase isn't for you, there are a variety of random password generators you can use to create random strings of many characters. However, those can be very, very hard to remember. That's why our second tip is to use a password manager and also to create a physical backup. Keep the physical copy somewhere secure and use the password manager, usually an app, on your device to help you recall or enter your information. Many mobile devices offer built-in password management, which is convenient and secure as long as you enable two-factor authentication, which brings us to our third tip, enabling two-factor authentication wherever possible. For mobile password managers, this can be using a biometric passkey like your fingerprint or facial recognition to confirm your password or login. For online accounts, you often can ask to be sent a text message with a code in addition to your password every time you attempt to log in. The few extra seconds it may take to access your account can keep it secure during a hacking attempt. Remember that security questions are often not enough to protect your password or account. Hackers can guess common answers in a few tries or find the answer on your social media account. Two-factor authentication is a much more secure and more reliable. Finally, if you stop using an account, make sure that you delete it. It's not enough to just remove the app from your phone or computer. Contact customer service and make sure your information is removed from the company's database. That way, even if they experience a data breach, your information will be secure. For more cybersecurity tips, visit the National Cybersecurity Council at staysafeonline.org. We'll be posting tips and advice throughout October. Thank you for tuning in. Remember that we post a video every week with tips and advice to help you become a wiser consumer.